Participants had expressed that discrimination had been experienced in healthcare settings. Some of them were aware that this was due to their ethnic identity. Others had expressed that the discrimination faced was not overt but still implied. Participants that did not experience outright discrimination in a healthcare setting still expressed concerns that they would possibly face discrimination if forced to go into a hospital wherein they would be the only minority in the healthcare setting due to their social stratification. I do have recollection of my mum's experience because she grew up in Trinidad so she has an accent. We had to go to the hospital and I felt like the staff in that particular hospital were quite dismissive of her and not necessarily paying attention to the pain that she was experiencing, not acknowledging or being sympathetic to her. The doctor basically wanted to give me Prozac. I asked her, why are you giving me Prozac? She then told me that half of Lewisham is on it so she didn't see a reason why not to give it me. The doctor wasn't part of our surgery. The guy that was doing the scan on my leg for the deep vein thrombosis was white. He made no eye contact whatsoever. He scanned my leg and I said to him, Excuse me, I'm sorry, but you're scanning in the wrong place. He turned around and categorically said, The notes say to scan this part of the leg, and that's what I'm doing. And he just turned away and carried on, and I knew he'd got it wrong. They were quicker to prescribe something that might be hazardous to your health than they were to a white person. They were quicker to say, take some depression tablets, than they would to a person of another ethnicity. Being a black male in my late 20s at the time, and the area that I live, you know, there's propaganda and stereotypes. Certain things exist and are in play to make people feel a way about us as a people. I believe there's no way I can't have experienced discrimination within the healthcare system because I think the system is geared towards being discriminatory. I'm a straightforward person. I think it's racial as the colour of my skin. I recall one time I had to go to the GP. She was a temporary GP that day and I requested a certain medication, painkillers, and she said, no, that's expensive. I said, I'm not leaving until you give me what I want. Some GPs come from a middle class background. They have a certain perception of those that are working class. I've experienced that myself, in some aspects, where a doctor was a bit condescending towards me. The segments held by our participants about the healthcare system are concerning, as it risks the chances of the person refusing to seek the necessary care due to how they believe they may be treated by healthcare professionals. 